Today I will tell you what is addition. Addition is the process of calculating the total of two or more numbers or addition is the process of adding something into something else. Now I will do an activity to clear this concept. Let's start our topic addition. You can see that I have four color pencils and my sister gives me five more. Now I will add them and I will calculate that how many color pencils do I have all together. Let's count 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 and 9. I have 9 color pencils all together. Our answer is 9. Now we are going to solve simple addition sum 52 plus 22. You can see that these are two digit numbers. So we have to write it on proper place value. First of all we will see that in 52 we have two ones. We will write here two in ones column and five in tens column. In 22 we have two ones and two ten. Remember to put addition sign here. Now we will add these two numbers all together. I have a small poem for you. So let's sing with me. Two in my mind and two on my fingers. Two, three and four. We have four ones. So we will write it in ones column. So let's sing again. Five in my mind and two on my fingers. Five, six and seven. We have seven tens. And we will write this 7 in tens column. So our answer is 74. Now we are going to solve simple addition word problem. In a cricket match, Shahid made 53 runs. Moise made 41 runs. How many runs did they make together? Students, there are few steps which will help you to solve these word problems easily. Let me tell you these steps. Step number one is make proper statements with each figure. Step number two is to put units on the top like tens and ones. Step number three is to put accurate sign by interpreting the whole problem. Step number four is write the solution. To solve this problem we have to write proper statements first. To solve this problem first of all we have to write proper statements. So let's read. In a cricket match Shahid made 53 runs. Moez made 41 runs. How many runs did they make together? Let's make statements now. First of all, we will write Shahid made runs. 53. So we will write 3 in 1's column and 5 in 10's column. Next is Moez made runs. 41. So we will write 1 in 1's column and 4 in 10's column. How many runs did they make together? Together means we have to add this. Now we have to add these two digit numbers all together. Now again sing that poem with me. Three in my mind and one on my finger. Three and one, four. We will write it in the ones column.
5 in my mind and 4 on my fingers. 5 in my mind and 4 on my fingers. 5, 6, 7, 8 and 9. We will write it here in tens column 9 and our answer is 94. So Shahid and Moez made 94 runs all together. Now let's start addition, converting ones. Look at these numbers 8 plus 2. It's single digit addition. 8 ones plus 2 ones. So we will write these numbers in ones column. 8 ones plus 2 ones. Where will we put the addition sign? Yes, here. How many ones do we have? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 and 8. Now, how many ones are here? Yes, two. One, two. Now I will add them all together. Let's start counting. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Our answer is 10. Can we write this 10 in ones column? No. We can't write tens in ones column. So what will we do now? We will convert 10 ones into 110. And we will shift 110 in 10's column. It means it will be carried forward to tens column. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9 and 10. We have shifted 110 here. So how many ones are left here? 0. So we will write 0 in 1's column and 1 in 10's column. So our answer is 10. This is another sum. 9 plus 3. 9 1's plus 3 1's. So now we have to find the answer. Do you remember we always start the place value from one side? So we will write 9 ones and 3 ones in ones column. 9 ones plus 3 ones. So how many ones do we have? Let's count. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 and 9. And we have 3 ones here. 1, 2, and 3. So, how many ones do we have all together? Let's count. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, and 12. So, our answer is 12. Can we write this 12? In ones column? No. It's not right. We cannot write the whole number in ones column. So, what should we do now? We have to change 12 into 110 and 2 ones. Let's make 110. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 
6, 7, 8, 9 and 10. We will make 1 10 and 2 ones. How many ones do we have? Yes, 2. And 1 10 will be carried forward in 10's column. And we will write here 1. Our answer is 12. Now we will do addition, converting ones. Here I have a word problem for you. It is very simple. Let's read with me. Maha plants 25 trees. Aisha plants 18 more. How many trees do they plant all together? Remember to write solution before solving the word problem. Now we will make this statement. Let's read with me. Maha plants 25 trees. So here we will write Maha plants trees 25. Aisha plants 18 more. So now our second statement will be Aisha plants more 18. We will write here 18. Now read the question. How many trees do they plant all together? What does it mean? It means we have to add these two numbers all together. All together means addition. So we will put the sign of addition over here. We we'll put the sign here. The sign of addition is plus. How many trees do they plant all together? So our third statement will be trees all together. So what did I tell you? That we always start addition from one side. So how many ones do we have? 5 and 8. Now we will add both ones all together. Let's count. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. Now we have 13 ones all together. Can we write 13 under ones column? No, we cannot write 13 in ones column. So we will change 13 into 110 and 3 ones. Let's make 110. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, and 10. And 3 ones. 1, 2, 3. We will shift 110 into tens column. And remaining three ones we will write in ones column. So we will write here three. Now we will do addition in tens column. Do you remember that we have shifted one ten over here in tens column? One ten. Next we have two tens and then one ten. Now we will add tens column 1 2 3 and 4 so we have 4 tens so we will write this 4 in tens column our answer is 43 so maha and aisha plant 43 trees
Now we are done with our addition word problem. Hopefully you have learnt simple addition and converting ones. Well, now you have to note down your homework. Thank you.